Web 2 and Web 3 are similar technologies with similar backgrounds. But they approach challenges differently. The fundamental distinction is that Web 2 focuses on reading and writing content. Whereas Web 3 focuses on creating content, semantic web. The latter is much better. Utilizing technology to facilitate information exchange amongst web users while simultaneously enhancing cybersecurity. Here are the differences between Web 2 and Web 3. Currency. Payments on Web 2 are made in fiat money. Government issued money, such as the US dollar, is used during transactions. Web 3, on the other hand, uses cryptocurrencies such as Ethereum or Bitcoin, which are encrypted digital currencies to fund transactions, content ownership. With Web 2, the network assumes control for information storage, causing access issues and concerns about the anonymity and protection of online data. Web3 solves this problem by letting data be exchanged in several locations simultaneously. Speed Web2 transfers are quicker than Web3 transfers. Web2 scans for information kept in a fixed place, generally on a single server. Using HTTP and unique web addresses, Web3 assigns ownership to numerous users. Technology The most common Web2 technologies include Ajax and JavaScript, HTML5, and CSS3, Machine Learning, Deep Learning, Semantic Web, and Decentralized Technologies Power Web3, Application. Web2 includes podcasts, social bookmarking, blogs, RSS feeds, and video sites. Web3 incorporates AI and machine learning powered apps, virtual worlds, and 3D portals, what are the benefits of Web3? The decentralized structure of Web3 is its primary advantage or value for users. Centralized networks will not be rewarded in the next generation of the Internet. While decentralization is one of the biggest benefits that Web3 could offer, the other ones include more privacy. Web3 will prioritize security and privacy over surveillance and control. Users will have complete control over their data. They have the option of sharing or keeping the information secret. Security Due to blockchain technology and its autonomous structure, it will also be safer than prior internet versions. Hackers will find it exceedingly tough to exploit the network. And even if they do, their activities will be logged. In a decentralized system, hacks are still plausible. Although most blockchains have developed defenses against such an occurrence, ubiquity. Multiple apps may access data. Each device is linked to the web. And services can be accessed anywhere. Semantic Web The Semantic Web is the next phase in the evolution of the Internet. Semantic Web enhances the whole experience of web-based platforms. Users may utilize semantic technologies to create online data repositories define vocabularies, and establish data handling rules. The technologies used to enable linked data are, RDF, OWL, SCOS, and Sparkle, connectivity. Data is intimately associated with Web3 due to semantic content, leading to an improved user experience that goes to a new level of connectivity that harnesses all accessible data. Here is the big question. Is Web3 the next reality of the Internet? Excitement and questions have been raised about the decentralized Internet. With its inherent lack of oversight and control for safety and legality, as Berners-Lee envisioned, Web3 will create a universal space ungoverned by a central authority. It will revolutionize how businesses interact with their customers, allowing companies to access the end users directly. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any questions leave them in the comments below. To know more, hit the article link in the description below. To stay updated with the latest in technology, visit spiceworks.com.